The Division I Boys State Semifinals matched up the Arrowhead Warhawks out of the Classic A Conference, taking on Brookfield Central out of the Greater Metro Conference. And Brookfield will get on the board first when Chris Post lays it up off the glass. Travell Cunningham was doing everything for the Warhawks. Here he is in the post and finds a cutting Alec Hamilton for the bucket. Off the Warhawk miss, Brookfield Central on the break and Gage Melancic would take it coast to coast for the score. This game featured two of the best point guards in the state. Watch my main man, Travell Cunningham, slices through the defense with the spin move and one. We go to the second half and Brookfield Central would take a 12 point lead off this Gage Melancic three. But Arrowhead will go on a serious run, and it all started with Marco Majetic drills this tray. The kid Travell Cunningham almost messed around and got a triple-double. Here he is knocking down the J. He finishes with 17 points, 11 rebounds, and 9 assists. This game will go into overtime, and your hero is Tommy Durant. He somehow gets his left hand layup to drop, putting Arrowhead up one. Brookfield Central gets the ball back with six seconds left, and Cole New could be your hero, folks. He drives to the rack, but it is blocked out of bounds by Alec Hamilton with .8 seconds left on the clock. One last chance, Brookfield Central inbounds the ball, but the shot is no good, and Arrowhead is your winner, 63-62. to We're really proud of our kids. We talked all season about you know, building to this, and uh, this week talked about leaving it all out on that cold center floor, no matter what happens. And you know, from a coaching standpoint, we couldn't we couldn't ask for any more. You know, it's the first time any of us have been here. A lot of a lot of lessons to learn, a lot of film to watch. Obviously, it's one game short for the seniors, but it was a great experience, and just hopefully to get back here next year. It looked like the entire population of Cedarburg turned out to see the Bulldogs try to get their first state tourney win in school history. They'd face a Milwaukee-Washington squad, which shared the city conference championship despite having only three seniors. Here's one of them, Jalen Stephan Holmes, on the receiving end of the alley-oop from Jordan Dinsmore. Cedarburg junior John Diener was nearly unstoppable. The DePaul recruit was scoring from just about everywhere in just about every way. Diener scored 26 in the first half, including the Bulldogs' final 10 points of the half, helping Cedarburg take a 10-point lead into the locker room. Diener would go on to score a state tournament record for all divisions with 46 points. Washington clamped down defensively in the second half and gradually closed the gap. Here's Tyree Ellis on the move, hitting sophomore Jonte Martin to tighten things up. Later, Deontay Long will rise, then drop it down to Ellis. This ties the game at 48. Ellis scored a team-high 23. It's tight the rest of the way, and John Diener keeps connecting. The basket won't let this one get away. It's a two-point Bulldogs lead late. The Pergolders keep on running, and Tyree Ellis uses a soft touch of his own. We're headed for overtime. Down two in OT, Washington battles for offensive boards until Kevin Clements puts it back up and in to tie it. Final minute of OT, we've got dueling Jordans. Jordan Johnson grabs his own miss and gives the Bulldogs the lead. With just a few ticks left on the clock, Jordan Dinsmore drives, his high floater reties the game. How about a second overtime? The biggest play of additional free basketball comes when Jared Short kicks it out to Jordan Johnson. His three ball gives Cedarburg the lead for good. 73-70 is the final, moving the Bulldogs to the title game and ending Washington's season at 22-5. The first half, we let them jump out early, get comfortable, um, got a 10-point lead on us. Just being a little nervous early, I think it allows some opportunities, a little bit, a couple more opportunities for um, um, Cedarburg to jump out on us like that. 